It is a controversial murder case that goes beyond, way beyond the murder itself. and includes an unusual cast of characters. Paul Venema sorts it out for us as jury selection wraps up in the Miguel Martinez murder trial. It has been over four years since 33-year-old Laura Carter, a UTSA graduate student, was shot to death in what prosecutors say was a botched drug deal. 30-year-old Miguel Martinez is accused of shooting Carter five times in the head as she sat in her car. His first trial ended in a mistrial, which sparked a bitter feud between Martinez's lawyer at the time, Joe Gonzalez, and DA Nico LaHood. Gonzalez accused LaHood of prosecutorial misconduct. Gonzalez would go on to run for district attorney against LaHood in 2018 and win. Fast forward to this retrial with Jason Goss appointed as special prosecutor. Gonzalez is not trying the case due to his prior involvement as Martinez defense attorney. Anytime that there's a case four and a half years, there's always challenges. Uh, this one has been especially challenging uh, because of the, of the procedural history. That is what Goss, who served as prosecutor during Martinez's first trial, said during a pre-trial hearing last month. He would not discuss the case as jury selection began here. He is now in private practice and part of former DA LaHood's law firm. Both sides playing this one close to the vest. Nobody's talking about trial strategy. We won't get our first glimpse of that until the first witness steps up here. Paul Venema, KSAT 12 News.